hello everyone and uh, welcome to wire or help and in this video i'm going to show you what is the difference between a forward request and a redirect request so basically here i have a simple login form here and i have two controllers uh, one is a home controller which is for my home page so the, which is for um, this one so which is map put to the, my root url and this this will return my home page and i have another controller called a user controller so this will be rendered uh, when i click on a login button here so these are the two controllers now i'm going to show you what is the difference between what happens when you forward a call and what happens when you uh, redirect a call now the basic thing is that so before going about a forward and return now uh, here when i click on login uh, I'm doing some processing. Uh, I'm, I'm printing a uh, line here, user uh, logged in, and I'm returning to home page. So this is the basic thing. So whenever uh, we complete our request, uh, we would return to we would return the view uh, to the spring. So that's how it works. Now let me show you what happens um, when I do like this. Now uh, I'm gonna uh, start my server. I think it's already started. I'm gonna restart my server. So uh, I'm going to go to my uh, login page and uh, I'm going to enter my stuff. So I'm going to click on login. It processed the request. You can see it says uh, user logged in and it returned the view, uh, which is nothing but uh, my home page. Now everything seems to be fine now. But let's see what happens when I click on uh, reload here and it's saying some. Um, uh, resubmission confirm confirmation so when I click on continue here it's gonna send another request as you can see it, it's displaying user logged in again so that means this request is processed again so now when I click on uh, reload again all right it's gonna process my request for the third time so now uh, so this might this might seem okay for the user login page but let's say for example if you're doing a payment processing form and if the user um, he tries to reload the page the payment will be processed twice and it's going to create a lot of problems and uh, let's say for example if the user is uh, registering himself and if you click on uh, reload uh, it's going to add uh, two entries in our databases so there are so many problems with this approach now uh, what happens when i try to use something like this now instead of returning a view what I'm trying to do is that I'm, I'm trying to forward my call uh, to my home page. So now I'm not just returning the view here, I'm uh, forwarding my call to the, the route which is my home. Now let me show you what happens when I do something like this. As usual, enter some stuff and when I click on login, alright. But as you can see here, uh, it processed my login and it went to my home controller which is here so that's the basic difference when you return uh, the view it won't go to the controller it will directly uh, return the view but if you forward your call like this it's gonna go to the respective mapping so here i map a route to this mapping so it's gonna come here and after coming here it's gonna return my view so let me, now let me show you what happens when I um, reload this page. Continue. So again, same thing. Still, my uh, user is, uh, I mean, login details are processed. So let me rerun again. It's still the same thing. So the problem still exists for us. So the thing with both approaches is that in both the cases, the HTTP request is still valid. So what happens is that when you resubmit, uh, it's trying to resubmit all the form data again to the controller. So that's how the forward works. So basically what we need is that we need a fresh redirect. I mean, when I redirect to the new URL, it should not um, process my old so now let me just try with the redirect now now uh, when i do something like this redirect it's a fresh uh, url so it's gonna go like this when i go to my local host and when i try to access 
uh, my home page is a fresh request for me so that's how uh, this redirect also works it's it's not going to remember your previous request or something stuff like that so let me show you what happens when i rerun again All right i'm going to go to my login page now i i filled my form data and as you can see it's a, it processed my login and it went to my home page but the thing is that when i click on uh, reload it's not going to my uh, user page again okay? it's not coming back to my login url and uh, if you even look at my url it's uh, previously it was a uh, user slash login now uh, it's uh, directly my uh, root url so that's how it works so no, no matter how many times i try to reload uh, it's not going to my it's not going back to my uh, user page so that's, that's how it works the basic difference is that with the redirect you're not forwarding any form data uh, it's a completely a new request so that's the basic difference guys uh, thanks for viewing if you like this video don't forget to subscribe us